what makes our map unique is that for the first time we estimated for every single lake um, how deep it is in average. Uh, we did that by looking at the elevation around the lake um, and then just um, extrapolated that into the lake, meaning that if you're in a hilly area, you might find deeper lakes than in flat areas. And that is new because we can now estimate with the depth and the surface area of the lake how much water is stored in every single lake. The data will um, become publicly available. Every researcher can use it for free for educational purposes. Um, it will be just downloadable on the website. But, um, people don't re realize early on, even myself was not fully aware that about 80% of all the water stored in lakes is actually stored in the top 10 largest lakes and all the other 1.4 million share the rest 20%. Right, there's more than 60% of, of lakes by number are found in Canada. So with, with our cut of a 10 hectare, we have nearly 1 million lakes in Canada alone, which I think makes Canada um, a prime country to maybe take on a special stewardship role for lakes. Yeah, well, so don't forget the key role that lakes play in uh, for, for Canada as being the natural hockey rinks. Without lakes, you might have not invented the sport up here.